October 27th, 2023. On June 10th, a film was shot 100 feet long and a print was made 100 feet long with this camera. I cut apart that negative and made more prints with less film in it so that the subject's all the same. And over time what I ended up with was this box of negatives and a notebook full of notes that are almost incomprehensible. And I've already made videos of these three 400 foot reels of films. Those cut negatives are hanging from the ceiling in the dark room. They're all from the one film. Now I have a table full of prints on 100 foot reels. Now these are all numbered and just recently I photographed them all with this video camera. They're all separate so each one is an individual file. But I also put all the files together into one giant video and I posted it with that original print that these negatives were cut from that are hanging next to me. So I've got to coordinate these with the negatives put numbers on the negatives that match these and then coordinate these two negatives and prints with the notes in the notebook to try to figure out if uh, I learned anything. <laughs> Those hanging negatives need to be rolled up and labeled like these or put on to 100 foot reels but they're not long enough so I'll roll them up like this. So starting with the first print, and I made notes whenever I projected these and made videos. I'm down in the basement so I'm not going to be looking at the videos. Number one is the 50 foot reel has four brackets. So I did the front street, the corner house, the house on the other corner because I did the dark brick house too. So this is an early bracket, four brackets, and I think I did the backyard bushes and the next door neighbor's garage with the tree in front of it because it's a dark siding and the tree had the light on it. I'm going to open this up and look at it and then I'm going to try to find a negative that matches it. This is a different page in the notebook and it was made whenever I looked at all the negatives but I didn't project them but I copied down what was on the leaders. October 1st 10 ASA no leader half full here it is, 50 foot spool, four brackets, black leader, the lighthouse on the corner starts it. This is the 50 foot spool. Looks like I don't have a date, but this is rubbed, rubbed off. It looked like October 1st. Okay, these notes on this page are from the loose prints. And the loose print, 50 foot, this is the loose print. And I think the date said October 1st. So I found a negative from October 1st. Okay, we have page 140, October 1st. It was 10 ASA, H16, Sonic 25, bright sun, but I was in the shade. The slate is first, and that's what was on the negative. I looked at it. Then the gray card was next, and then there was a big long section with nothing, so that must have been F22 of the corner house because I was in the shade and the house was only a little spot in the middle. It started to show. It was bracketed in half steps, so that begins a bracket. And then the other house on the opposite corner is a bracket. Then the back porch left garage is a bracket. And then the bushes to the right is a bracket. Good. So I'm going to go upstairs and look at the video of number one print reel. Moved upstairs. I opened up the October 25th file on the laptop. The first video is the one. Yes. This is the smallest reel, the 50 foot reel, October 1st. It's a long shot. Starts with the house on the corner, then the other corner, then the bushes, I mean, then the garage, and eventually the bushes on the right. 
Now the other thing that I have to coordinate to is the Word Perfect document. So I have to find where October 1st bracket is in there. And I probably published it to YouTube, so it may have a link to a YouTube video. If not, I have a new uh, copy of it. Not a very good one, but I have a copy of the print. So now I have to scroll to find October 10th, because I don't have a table of contents yet. There's, that was the original June 10th. So there are a lot of dates on here. So June 15th. This is so long that if I had jumped to the end, it would still be in the middle. Alright, there are a lot of link videos here, but it's only August yet. September 11th. Dormer, September 14th. This looks like it. No, wrong camera. All right. This is not made consistently enough to be able to find things quickly. I couldn't find a date. I'm still looking for a date. 10 ASA print 2, print 2, Cine Codec Model BB, September 26, 27, 28. That's the fingers test. Oh, here. What's this? Vlog 11, four brackets. That may be it. You're going to have to go look it up. Am I online? No. Page 52 in the WordPerfect document. I do have page numbers, if not a table of contents. I'm online now, so let's see when this was made. Blog 11, four brackets, October 2nd. That should be it. October 1st. This is a vlog, so it's long. I wanted to photograph them later. A new page in my notebook was begun to tabulate all this data. October 27th is the date, and this is negatives, prints, and data. So number one is four brackets. That's the title. It's on page 140 in this notebook for October 1st, 2023. It's number one negative, number one print, that's one negative, and that's a one print. It's on page 52 in Word Perfect, and it's vlog 11, four brackets, that's the title, dated October 2nd, 2023, on YouTube. Now the description has a nice clue for other prints and negatives that I have to figure out. Here it is. The last of the Sonic 25 was used up. The question was, could a bracket made of landscapes become more dense than I had gotten because previous films were so thin? The first print was made at 2 volts and seemed to be too dark. All right, so that's the print that I have. I don't know if it's too dark or not. So a second print was made, as before, at one and three quarter volts, less light, so it would be lighter. But that turned out to be too light. And I wanted the leader to be very dark, almost opaque. So the very last bit of the bracket, these are the bushes in the backyard, was used to print a sample at two and a half volts. And I remember seeing that. That's one of the films that I have already numbered and found and videoed and all. It, it's a short one. 
and uh, it turned out pretty nice actually. So we will be seeing that shortly. There are additional comments that I made about the production of the print and what to do next as there are notes in the notebook. So when I get around to figuring out what I did and what could be done next or what would follow this would be another longer one at one uh, of the brackets. Uh, the, th the middle bracket is usually 10 ASA. So what to do next. I have to pick one that looks good to me for that view and then make a long one. That's what I usually do. The prints were not numbered chronologically. They were done haphazardly. But they are numbered. They were numbered according to which one I grabbed and made a video of. The negatives had dates on most of them and information on the prints also and I tried to make a list in the notebook but they're out of order so what I ended up doing was simply circling the dates and those numbered lists are out of order. So now I gotta put them into chronological order according to the notes in the notebook. So here's the second negative. It had unraveled in the box and was like almost four feet out. So I had to wind it back up and then tape it. It has a little bit of white leader and the date is on it. So this is the number two. N means negative and that's the date. So this is the print. Number two print haphazardly selected. Uh, there's no white leader on it. And I've started an entry in the notebook. Now I have to go look up notes and find the video. Number two, video. What is it? Number 16, this does not have any white leader. So it starts with a corner house. Oh, this is different. I use three different lenses. Long shot, medium shot, close up. On YouTube, I chose my channel and manage videos. And I scroll down and I see that there is no video between October 2nd and October 20th. So October 16th was not posted online. So I'm going to post that. It'll be out of order, but it'll be up there and then I can link it so I can have a video in my document Word Perfect PDF. It looks like the third video of print, October 18th, 2023, is another version of the second negative. There won't be a negative that matches this one because it's the th another print of the same negative of October 16th. I need a break. This is complicated. Coffee for my brain cells. Whew. I had to stop after number six and update the Word Perfect document. The number seven negative is next, and it's from the BB camera. I just wanted to say that the negatives in the box don't necessarily match or link up to the prints that were loose in the dark room. So there may not be a negative for number seven, or there is. All of the prints that were videoed recently have been matched up to negatives that were in the cardboard box, and all of the reels are accounted for. There are four little rolls of negatives that are not on reels that are wound up in the box loosely. They're going to go into the shoe box, which is I have two shoe boxes, one of negatives and one of prints. So the uh, WordPerfect document was updated as much as possible. Many videos were uploaded to YouTube and I tried to 
describe what they were and why there were a lot of duplicates. Uh, they're not exactly duplicates, okay? But, yeah, they are. You've seen them before. Uh, they were necessary to put up there so that I can have a more clear uh, selection showing on the word perfect links. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching. You can subscribe and like and comment. I would really like to hear from people, but you know, this, this work is ongoing. I don't know if anybody else has ever done this kind of work. I can't imagine how people used to do it to make motion pictures. I mean, real motion pictures, big ones, using film. So the assistant camera people probably had to do this. I think assistant people did all this kind of stuff of logging work prints and uh, rough cuts and things like that. It's pretty labor intensive, but I'm only working with film. That's it. So maybe some of these 400 footers that I did could be set away to uh, be scanned. And then I could actually do some digital work on them. We'll see. I don't know. Maybe later. That's all for now. Bye.